Hello, dear my television neighbor. It's me, Mr. Roberts. I'm going to show you today how I eat my portobello mushroom six dollar burger. Now it's already magically disappeared and down my stomach, so I can't show you right now. But how I eat my six dollar burger is number one, you don't eat the cardboard. Because remember, these burgers are not meant to taste like cardboard. This is not McDonald's. Number three, I basically don't go to the Carlos Jr. all depressed, eating my burger, like, leave me alone, Fred, jump to me, and, and, and just let me eat my burger and taste, because Mr. Roberts always recommends do not eat your $6 burger while you're depressed. Because you may not realize that in one of these burgers there's like a thousand calories, 50 grams of fat, and about 2,000 milligrams of soap. I wouldn't want anyone getting mad at me because Mr. Roberts, do you not realize my friend had a heart attack and died because you suggested you should eat these six dollar burgers while you're depressed and since my friend was depressed he killed himself off of these six dollar burgers you know I wouldn't want that but how I eat my burger is I make sure I have an empty stomach so I can eat the whole burger because if I don't have an empty stomach then only half eat the burger and I'll end up giving the other half to maybe some homeless person but these six dollar burgers you know Carl's Jr. is just so great there's such a nice atmosphere because if I went to McDonald's you know what I'd be you know I just think of Ronald McDonald I can't get that stuck out of my head so when I'm at McDonald's I'm like weirdo weirdo homeless person fat guy and if I went to say Burger King, then I just can't get that image out of my head of that creepy guy in a Burger King costume. He just like comes up to me with this burger. It's like, eat. And it's like, oh, I'm supposed to eat this burger. But, but what happens if he poisoned it? Should I eat it? I mean, Carl's Jr. is just so much better. And when I eat one of these burgers, I can throw my nutrition out the window. Who cares if I die because I ate all this bad Carl's Jr. food? Good boy.